How is everybody doing today? My name is Master Zero, and welcome back to another reaction video. This time we're reacting to your immune system is more dangerous than you think by In A Nutshell. Alright, so this is what going on like episode 4 now, of, not episode, video that I've reacted to that has to do with the immune system by In A Nutshell, you know? But like, I'm still not like tired of it, you know? <laughs> like, I'm still like really anticipating this video because like, the, the fact that like they do their job right like long story short lack of a better word man they do their job and they do it perfect like the fact that they have like little bite-sized pieces of information that they give us and they make it super enjoyable and like they can help understand like these really really complex things like your body for instance let's not even talk about space or anything let's just go like not even your house like the most basic thing which is you and it's not even basic it is like the most extreme thing ever and i freaking love it you know so like i, I just love these videos so freaking much and i really want to get it started so without any further ado here is your immune system is more dangerous than you think there's this idea floating around oh i was literally about to say it's like a fight makes game you stronger that surviving a disease leaves That's you usually what the immune system is, and right? It seems to make sense because we've all experienced I wonder this. if this one's gonna be negative when though. When you go through hardship, often well, you come out more I have the same plushie. Or ready to face a difficult situation in the future. That's a big one. But it turns out that sometimes what doesn't kill you makes you weaker. Oh. So what happens Do elaborate. When you get sick? Monkey. Ah, that was a given, right? He would be holding the thing that it just showed him. And I don't know what's going on with my hair. I already had to fix it like the four machinery times. Of war. What? Think of yourself as a large country with I'm not... a sizable army to defend it. I was universe in the last You're one. Surrounded <laughs> by enemies that want to take your land, your ah. energy, your resources. This See what is I mean, man. Bite-sized pieces. So your body evolved to be sensitive to damage okay. and to the presence of enemies. Ooh. Because this means that an invasion might happen at any moment Ooh. and that it has to act fast. Why Let's would you let your dog do that? That's just disgusting. I'm a cat guy. The moment your cells notice that something is off, they release an onslaught is that a of warning sign? proteins called cytokines. I should know some They're of this like stuff now, man. Like I said, this is like the fourth all sorts video. Of cells that then themselves release many more cytokines, amplifying the alarm. Soon, you're flooded with signals that trigger oh. precautions and countermeasures. You zoom out like that, man. Actually, seeing all of them. Your brain activates sickness Whoa. behavior and reorganizes your body's priorities to defense. Off to bed. The first thing you notice is that your energy level drops and you get sleepy. You feel apathetic, often anxious or down. He's just explaining like what appetite. happens when you get sick, but your I love sensitivity it. Sensitivity to pain is heightened, oh. and you yes. seek out rest. My All hands or arms feel to weird. Your energy and reroute it into your immune response. I'm just going to do this. You become a country under attack, switching into a war economy. Because All right. reactivating your immune system is intensely disruptive and draining. Just like war is expensive for a country. As yeah, country okay. To building tanks, your immune I mean, I don't like the huge war energy, word, but amino acids, and it's a very good to build its weapons. picture. Take fever. It speeds up your metabolism and makes your cells work harder and faster while creating heat that's pretty stressful for many invaders, but it uses up a lot uh -huh. of calories to maintain. See, this is all like basic information, but like to actually like have him address it. Specialized immune cells to respond specifically to the enemy infecting you. B cells produce millions your body be of smart, man. every second, each requiring Can't wait for the hundreds part. of amino acids to construct. Billions that's, that's or even it. trillions of proteins need to be made to refresh the complement system a mind hey inside your blood. That's what I love also, man. It's like kinds, the past videos help me better understand the future ones, you know? Constant they do it on purpose. Usually, you acquire your resources by eating. Yes. But when you're sick, your body slows down your digestion yeah. because it needs a lot of energy you can't Wait, spare. I did not so know that. It slows down your digestive system? Amino acids and starts breaking down your muscles. Let's go! Okay! So hard I'll learn something new! Sacrificed to keep you alive. I don't have yet. I if mean, my muscle looks like it's on top of actual bone. It looks weird. <laughs> once you're better. I'm a skinny boy. But if you're old or very young, oh. weak or suffer from chronic illness, this may be that way too bird. Drained. Your body is literally consuming itself to keep the defense going. When you put it that way. If your whole system is already strained, when you get sick, just keeping your immune responses going can overwhelm oh. your capacities. That's that's totally your understandable, yeah. A jerk. Okay. Our enemies too. Your immune system is as dangerous to you, you and the as enemy. it is to enemies. Okay. There's a very fragile balance between the damage caused by an infection like muskets, man. and the collateral damage caused by immune cells. One of your first responders are neutrophils. Imagine Stickers? crazy aggressive chimps with machine guns. 
If a new what? Encounters enemies, like it Planet of the Apes? That cut them open, Caesar going but on? can also damage civilian cells, especially if the patient is already compromised, for example, by smoking. I got it. Yeah. Oh, that, the yeah, that's a big one, huh? That you often release chemicals and toxins yeah, they're just that can blindlessly aiming at everything. So a serious infection often causes many tiny uh -huh. wounds, literally holes in your organs. As oh. you can imagine, it's not great to call them holes. holes in your organs, and I guess technically that's what they are. I don't them. know what's going on in my hair your right now. Your neutrophils and macrophages help by releasing chemicals that signal the body to start repairs, and most of the damage is quickly filled up with. I like the little visual cells. effect that they like. It's like but dancing in a way, like when collagen, the bees dance. A sort of fixal organic cement that gives your gooey tissue structural integrity. You All see right. the result in your skin. Yeah, scars. I always peel it. A scar is different from the original tissue. Oh. It has no functioning cells in it. It's like a sloppily applied cement patch. It can't do what the original tissue was doing. A scar on your heart makes it beat a tiny bit weaker. A scar on the lungs no longer captures oxygen. It's just, a I mean, it's obvious. It's so obvious, it mind you, filter. but... I never so thought about it. Life and like, of disease, course it's slower. Disease, it's not the, the original. Your organs may decrease. The damage is usually small enough not to affect your quality of life, but can be permanent. Okay. So after a while, like, but there is actually something <laughs> you can do to avoid you said it, not me. damage and train immune your boost. immune system. Yeah, growing older means to train vitamins. Your immune system. Your immune system is unique. Everyone has a slightly different immune system. Yeah. That's stronger against We're all snowflakes. And weaker not the. <laughs> Which makes evolutionary sense. Not the bad snowflake, but like we're all individually like a snowflake. By a single infection. Oh. Collectively, the immune system of the human species is a spectrum. Most people respond well enough to an infection. Hiya. A few are super responders, and a few don't respond well and die. <laughs> Some people survive the Black Death, are more resistant to HIV or coronavirus, or even resistant against Ebola. Why Others is he are killed like easily by the gross flu, or are highly vulnerable to certain bacteria. And he's just happy to be here. Where you okay. are on this spectrum is impossible to predict. Yeah. And you also I don't even think you would know. Would your body know? Infection. I guess. This is why seemingly very healthy young people died from COVID, while for some elderly people, uh -huh. it was more yeah. like a mild flu. And then they the were like, oh, oh only old people get it. Diseases if you never get a and all stupid kids that went to the beach. You never know I'm what your that immune time. system is good at until it's tested. Right on. Getting sick is a gamble in life's casino with your health on the line. Always. But Always low prices. You can do, hacking one of the best features of your immune system. I don't when like what I've disease, become. Usually you have better defenses against it afterwards. Okay. You gain memory that is true. Very good at killing the specific enemy Unless it mutates and turns into something so else. It's like both disease things disease are like evolving. Or the next infection is much milder. And That's you cool. can use an incredible achievement of human ingenuity Medicine. Into this mechanism to prevent damage from disease. I don't know though, man, like, train your the people system. behind the vaccines, vaccines. and medicine. Vaccines very, very iffy for me. Disease. Like, and train your defenses to be ready they're all about profit, not really real. helping the people. The goal is to create the same memory cells that you would get after surviving an infection. That's cool. That's the coolest effects, visual ever. It's like a training dummy. It? Nature versus vaccine dojo. Dojo, I was literally you have awesome. Two options We're on the same page. System, vaccine dojo and nature dojo. Oh, it's in like I'm playing Digimon dojo, World, man. Train with paper weapons and learn to defend yourself. I love this. Sure, you might get a black eye or a bruise. Neat. Sometimes after a vaccine, you get sick for a few days, but that's generally. Yeah, when I took the flu no shot, man, stars, I got like no sick. My whole damage. arm went numb. We it was scary. Yeah. Side <laughs> effects in detail in another video if you want to learn more. I did. On the other hand, getting a disease to become immune means going to a nature dojo. In nature dojo, you train with real weapons, sharp knives, and swords. Dude, the Things visualization. Out, I respect but with way it. More cuts and wounds. But from time to time, someone will die. Be it yeah. a kid from measles or an adult from influenza. Nature dojo is just. And it seems like nature risky. just keeps On just that, pushing out new waves. The you get from a vaccine is often better than the natural resistance because they're oh. engineered to engage your immune system in a more productive way. I agree way. 100%, man. Of course, vaccines, vaccines are, are literally made to do that, you know? Sometimes they don't protect us as well as we'd Just like rub some to. dirt in my wound Maybe when I was a kid. Maybe because mutates too quickly, like the Omicron coronavirus, yeah. or because your specific immune system does not respond well to the vaccine and builds less of a defense. Still, being okay. vaccinated is one of the best tools to So the to vaccine could be harmful defenses. as well. 
Not as bad, mind you, end, but... If we look at the stunning progress humanity has made in the last century... What's going on there, buddy? We may overcome <laughs> disease for good. But until then, we can... Ah, uh, can you imagine, though? That's hopeful thinking. And others. Your body and your older self will be That's... grateful to you. A little somber piano Diseases at the end there, kind of like Mr. Rogers or something. Humanity can address if we work together. We believe the same is true for climate change, one of the main challenges of our generation. Yeah. We're very passionate about if not this the topic, main one. and we've covered it extensively in previous videos. Yeah, have I watched Humanity all of them? To tackle this problem Maybe not the last one. Of society, from governments and economies down to the individual. Yes. And there's one way you can take action now, by working Show with me. our friends from Wren, who You're help you new, offset your but I like the bird. <laughs> By Very topical. Co and answering a few questions, you can find out what your personal carbon footprint is. Mine is like non-existent, my man. I mean, obviously it's not non-existent, but... but there are limits to that. Ren lets you offset the rest of your I carbon footprint with a lot of subscription <laughs> that supports projects that plant trees, protect rainforests, and remove carbon dioxide from Let's the sky. Let's go! Sky. All we positive things. Many puzzle pieces that important, make a important real things in the climate crisis. Once you sign up to make another video, you'll get pictures familiar. and updates from the project you support, so you can directly see the impact you're making. That's beautiful. We appreciate Ren's hey. focus on transparency is that Yellowstone? and that looks impact, like... I went so to Yellowstone. you can always retrace like how your money is spent. One project we find especially interesting is refrigerant construction. Oh, Old was... refrigerators use harmful gases as a coolant. What? These gases, once released into the atmosphere, something I didn't even know was a problem, man. Faster than <laughs> CO2. Ren's project permanently destroys containers filled with these Can gases. Can you not get rid of them? Is there not a safe way to get rid of them? They'll never leak and contribute to global warming. Thank you. Sign They're trying to do that. I got it. Okay. <laughs> to start helping the planet. That's it. That's good. Cool. change is close to our Godspeed. We will personally Ren. pay for the first month of subscription for the first 200 people to sign Hey, up. I might get that. I'm an hour. Just an hour behind. Into the fascinating I'm actually not a week behind. And check out these products in our shop. Learn more about immune cells have to bring and marvel at battles that are fought in your body every day. All of our products are designed with love and produced with care. God, I swear I'm gonna get a poster, man. I mean, I'm already satisfied with my deck. Yeah. <laughs> so, all right, man, that was just really enjoyable, man. I just love that. Like, I love the. I don't know if you guys noticed, but like, if it has to do with like your body or space, like those two video topics of Kurt's Cat is the ones that I really, really like get like super giddy with because it's like. It, I don't know, man, because your body, like, in my mind, your body is its own universe, you know? Like, with all the different cells and, like, molecules and, like, viruses and literally everything that accumulates you as a person, you know? Like, it, it's hard to believe that you're anything more than this, like, just very special thing, you know? Like, it's freaking crazy. Like, you're your own universe is what that one video said, and then here you're your own, you're your own like, source of land or whatever he said, a little colony or something, but like, it's just so cool to think about that kind of stuff, you know? And then like, you watch a video like this, for instance, and it's like, it takes it into bite-sized pieces for you, and then it kind of like, hand feeds it to you in a way that you better understand it, and then like, that spark of interest really ignites inside you, you know? And like, that's what, I know I say that in almost every single, like, in a nutshell video I react to but like it's true like I'm trying to like staple home like it's it's just the coolest freaking thing in my opinion like helping these people or everyone mind you like anyone can just watch this like it's free like it's on YouTube like for anyone to just like stumble across their videos and like learn like really appreciate like what's out there in the world like not not just like the world or space or anything but like even smaller scale like you like you as a person like what is inside you like that stuff is so freaking fascinating to me and like I love it with a passion like i cannot get enough of their videos so i'm gonna i'm gonna end it there but this, this is awesome man awesome stuff i love it so much so thank everybody so much for watching leave a like down below subscribe ring the bell become a member you get videos a day early and check out the merch so with that said i am a master zero y'all guys have been fantastic and i'll see y'all in the next episode later days